Hey guys, today on Divas Can Cook, we are taking fresh blueberries and we are creating the best brunch spring summer cookie ever. I am talking about these blueberry muffin cookies, that fluffiness, y'all, yes. I am here for all of that and it's easy to make, so let's go. Okay, we're gonna start with our dry ingredients. I'm gonna add some baking soda, baking powder, and salt into my flour. I'm gonna whisk this all around and make sure that everything is well combined just like that it looks perfect okay now we're gonna set this aside and we're gonna move on to our wet ingredients I'm gonna add some softened butter into a large bowl next I'm hold on now Liz okay get the butter in there girl okay next we're gonna add in a little bit of oh cream cheese fill right in we're gonna go ahead and blend this I mean mix this on up until that butter and cream cheese become one and united and then we're gonna add in our sugar okay a little bit of sugar goes in there we're gonna cream this just until it is combined don't over cream it okay don't over cream it because then you're gonna have like chewy cookies and not fluffy cookies I'm gonna add in an egg mix that in just until it is combined and then stop your batter will look like this all creamy and whipped mm -hmm, that looks pretty all right so once your batter is looking like this right here you can go ahead and add in your vanilla extract there's that vanilla going in you can also add in a little bit of lemon extract if you want to but I'm just gonna add in a little bit of lemon zest okay that's all the zest I need right there just a little bit not much and just stir that lemon zest in there and next we're gonna mix our dry ingredients with our wet ingredients Okay, we're gonna stir it up just until we have a nice soft dough. Now normally I would do this entire recipe just using my rubber spatula. I don't even use the mixer because like I said, you cannot over mix this. So if you're nervous about over mixing it, just use a spatula, you'll be good to go. Okay, so next we're gonna add in our blueberries. I like this part, our blueberries. Now, when you add your blueberries in here, you have to be super duper careful to go as light as you can because you don't wanna break the blueberries open because it will streak your batter and it will turn it a weird gray color. And we don't want that. It's okay if a few of them break open, but try to be very, very gentle. I always break open at least a few of them, but just try your best to use a very, very light hand. Okay, now I'm going to scoop these out by the tablespoon. I like to use a heaping tablespoon. Actually, it's kind of easier to just use a regular spoon because this dough is so sticky. I'm like, oh my God, it won't even come out of my cookie scoop. So yeah, it's probably easier to use a regular spoon and just like scoop them out. And now if you want more blueberries, I like to cheat and just push some into the batter. You know, that way it's like bursting with blueberries and stuff. That's optional though. Okay, so now we're gonna bake these at 350 for about 13 to 15 minutes, okay? When they come out, they'll be nice and fluffy and light. Let them hang out in the pan for a bit before removing them to a cooling rack to cool completely. And you guys, that is it. You have a amazing and amazing brunch cookie to serve for Mother's Day, spring, summer, all that. Now, if you want to drizzle these with a little bit of glaze, I would put that recipe on my blog, but you can put glaze on there, some little lemon zest, but I like it simple. Simple, simple, just like this. It tastes like blueberry muffin tops. They're just so good. And that's it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe and check out my other videos. Later.